going on, Russo? Welcome back, Russoians. That's what I call you guys now, Russoians. Uh, it's not. That's actually terrible. Um, we're here and we are playing YouTube Simulator once again for our second edition of this update. Basically, as an extra content type of second channel video, I wanted to take all of these things that I earned, all of these cups, all of these uh, potions, if you will, and play buttons and convert them and actually make them good plaques so that they can start giving me a lot more money. Um, as we know, the nature plaque is like the best. We need water plaques in order to get them. We need gold potions in order to get those. It's, it's a mess, dude. We don't have that many gold potions, but what we do have... Actually, how many gold pl play buttons do we have? Or gold uh, things do we have? Okay, we have three. Um, that's, that's pretty much it. That's, that's, that's pretty much, yep, yeah, that's, that's pretty much all we have. Why are gold play buttons so hard to get, bro? Well, in this video, we're going to be converting a ton of our plaques into better ones to get this boost up. How much does the water plaque give us, by the way? That's a thousand. So we might want to keep that one down. It's so hard because, like, I could make water plaques, but I could also get this giant boost from the fountain thing. Like, I feel like this would be better off if we got ourselves the fresh water. This right here. So, we need water potions. We need so many. Nine water potions. And then we need... Oh my gosh! We need nine water potions. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of those. So, eight times nine, whatever that is. How do you get that many water things, bro? You, I need a lot of gold potions. And those are just hard to come by. All right, so we're probably going to ultimately have to just get more coins, more tokens, and open this thing a lot. That's that's basically the only way. All right, let's go over here and see what we have so far. I got a bunch of chairs in my last video. If you didn't see that, make sure you check it out on my main channel. And also, like the video. Subscribe if you're new. I don't really push for that stuff too much here, but like, I wish you could do more chairs that, than one. That would just be... That would just be heavenly because this is still too long, bro. We just need more automation, bro. Like, give me more. Sorry, just just a little bit needy. Um, but yeah, make sure you like and subscribe. I don't really say that much on this channel, but it's it's very important. We're almost at 200k subs. You know the deal, all right? It all helps us towards the YouTube algorithm and get more eyes on our stuff. Um, okay, we got a lot of these which we can make cups with and stuff, but we can't make gold. That's all I need. All I need is gold potions. I want to make water plaques so that we can convert those into water potions, which will then give us, you know, it, it'll give us what we need. It'll give us, I mean, we can get this nature plaque, but like we can also just get the actual water bottle boost, which is going to help us a lot. So I definitely want to get that boost multiplier. I'm wondering if it's better to just get a bunch of nature plaques or a bunch of those waters and get the boost. I feel like I want the boost, but it's just so hard. I have one gold. I can place a cup and I can make three more. So let's go ahead and make these. And then let's melt our current water plaque. It sucks to do it, but I got to do it. So we'll take that. We'll put the water plaque there. Sorry, water plaque. Got to melt you. It's, it's not you. It's me. All right. We got the water potion out. See, that's one water potion. And I need a lot of them. That's why I'm just like, how is this going to be possible to actually make what I need to do. Wait a second, I keep forgetting! I keep forgetting! I can use two of these to make gold potions. I'm so dumb, I keep forgetting. Gold potions are hard to come by, but you know what? Now that I have a lot of cups, I can make gold potions with these silver ones. I take two silvers and I make a gold potion, right? Is that is that what I do? I actually can't remember. Wait, how do I make a gold potion again? Uh, two silver gold plaque. That's what it is. So two silvers makes a gold plaque. So if I take this and I go here, silver, and then I add another silver, that's how I get a gold plaque. I remember now. I remember now. Remember when I used to stream and I would say, I'm a member now, whenever you guys became a member. If you don't remember that, you're not an OG Russo Pays fan. I mean, plays. All right, so I got a gold play button. Nice. So it might not be too, too hard to get this. There's one water potion. Let's make a second by taking this and this. And we got ourselves a water plaque. Wait, what does this make us again? This makes us 
a water plaque, right? And then we take that and make a water potion. I see, I see. Okay, so we have two water potions. We're on our way to that water bottle thing. It's gonna be pretty hard to get that many, but at least I'm actually on my way and making progress. Let's make another gold. And we're just gonna have to melt, how many cups do I have? We're gonna have to melt all of these 14. And how many tokens do I have? None, right? I used all of them. I used all the tokens. So we're gonna have to go through all of the rebirths again. We're gonna have to do a lot of grinding, guys. That's just, that's just what we have to do. All right, so we have two water potions. Let's take these. Let's make another water plaque. And we'll have, we'll have about three water potions. So ultimately we're doing pretty good. But like, we're still very, very, very behind making this water bottle concoction to get ourselves that Aquafina, Dasani, whatever it is, um, <laughs> ultimate multiplier. I don't know how much it multiplies by, but it increases your boost by a lot. And that's what we need. And this is just what it takes, apparently. So I guess let's just make some more silvers. Keep making gold. That's that's it's a grind. It's a grind to do this. They definitely should create a way to do this faster, even though you could skip everything and make things faster. It's still kind of just tedious, but you know, it's whatever. I got a silver in there. I could take this. I could skip this. Put a silver there. Oh, that's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. I'm gonna have to remove this. I'm gonna have to put another silver. Bam. Okay. And that'll make a gold play button. Okay. So, another gold play button. But that leaves me with how many water potions total? How many water potions do I totally have right now? I have three. That's literally, I, I really can't make that much more than three. I could probably make five or six with all the cups I have. So that's clear to me that we're going to need a faster grind. We're going to need to actually like start, start this grind up again. The owner actually said something about editors. They said something about finally adding editors in the game. I really sincerely hope they do because something about this current grind is kind of annoying. Like you have to do so much in this game, you know, and I know that sounds like entitled, like, you're supposed to play the game and do stuff, but since you already have to like run around, make potions, get items, get upgrades, unlock things out of the token shop and record videos, it'd be nice if while you're recording, your money could go up because people are editing in your studio for you. You know what I mean? Like how cool would that actually be? I would be down. Does this, can you get five of these yet? You can put up to three. Okay, no, they didn't change it. I thought they changed it to five, but it's still three. So let's grab this guy right here, grab this guy right here. We gotta get our way back to those alien computers and you know, start getting the core blocks tokens again and all those tokens so that we can start up this, uh, I kinda wanna do the token flip game again and get like an am amazing amount of tokens, like an insane amount. But it's almost more worth it to do the alien rebirth and get like all of those upgrades. And actually, you know what I could do is I could take I, I could I could not actually go to the alien rebirth and I could just do the normal rebirth with all of those computer upgrades. Oh, no, but you kind of need the alien stuff to actually get those computer upgrades. You know what I mean? It's just it's such a grind at this point, bro. All right, we got to put the yellow one down. There we go. The problem with taking those water plaques and making them into potions is I'm missing out on a really big boost percentage. If you guys are pros at this game, is it better to have like a big boost percentage or is it better to have like a boost multiplier number? You know what I mean? Like what is more important? Is it that percentage or is it the boost multiplier number? I don't actually know what's more valuable. If we look here, how much does this actually give us this freshwater one? So increases your multiplier by two stacks up to two. This will only increase my multiplier to 23 and then again to 25. That's actually probably not worth it. I feel like the percentage is going to be higher if I just make like nature plaques. You know what I mean? Like if I if I make a nature plaque right now, if I make two, I'll go up to almost 20,000 percent. Will that be way better? Like, is that better than getting my boost multiplier up? I don't know. There must be a reason why they want you to get these boost multipliers up so much, but I don't know which one is actually more valuable quicker you know what i mean oh wait i can buy like this one already i can buy this one and then i could buy wait do i already have this one 
Oh, it was just a glitch. Okay, um, so I'm gonna do this a little bit longer and get a little bit ahead on like what kind of computer I have and stuff. Actually, you know what? No, I'm not gonna do that. I'm changing my mind mid-video. I'm going to make a few more potions and I'm just gonna make nature plaques. Because getting that water bottle thing is gonna be freaking impossible with my current rate. Gonna go ahead and shred a chair, why not? I'm gonna take two water potions and I'm gonna make this nature plaque because the nature plaques are the best that you can get in this zone at least. I don't know if they're better ones in the core blocks thing. I haven't seen one yet, but this nature plaque is pretty dang good. And we're gonna go ahead and put a gold right there, melt that, get that going. We got the nature plaque, there we go. We got another water one and a gold one. So we can make a water plaque with these two golds. So let's take gold and then we'll go gold. There we go. There we go. And now we can make this into a water plaque, which then lets us melt it into a water potion, which then lets us get another nature plaque. There we go. Look at that. So easy. So easy a, a caveman could do it. So easy a Russo could do it. Another water. There we go. Now I got multiple nature plaques, dude. No big deal. Now this update is actually really, really cool. I really like this update, the plaques that they had. I know none of this is like part of the new update, um, but it came out really, really cool. The fact that you can open so many chests now is really awesome. I just still find it really hard to get tokens. I feel like I keep forgetting about my spins too. I have so many spins. I have like 16 spin token or uh, passes. And I got a token, see? Might as well start spinning that thing. But yeah, it's just, really slow progress in getting tokens in my opinion and i just wish there was an easier way to get them but let's go ahead and place these down and see what i'm starting to get with my boost multiplier now so we'll go ahead and we'll open this nature plaque in there don't mind if i do look at that 2000 boost another one bam wait oh it says zero i'm like do i have a water plaque yeah it says zero so now my boost multiplier is at twenty thousand. i don't know if that's going to be much more significantly noticeable whoops oh yeah i did the computer i'm good um so let's take this purple one and let's see how much money i'm getting okay i can't really tell if this is like much more significant than what it was but it seems to be pretty good that twenty thousand boost over 15 or 16 is what i had before that's pretty worth it if you guys are pros what's more worth it is it worth it to get myself the water possessed water boost and get my multiplier up to 25 million or to 25 or is it worth getting my boost percentage up let me know in the comments. Um, I actually almost have enough for this. Can I buy this? Okay, now I can probably buy it. Yeah, I can buy it. I'm just gonna do this. I'm just gonna Robux my way there to victory. Sweet, sweet victory. So, now that I'm here, I can, I can do my rebirth and I can start token flipping. I kinda wanna do that, but I also wanna get these and I wanna get like the token boost before I rebirth, you know what I'm saying? But I also want to token flip. All right, I'm just going to token flip. I'm, I'm going to do a token flip for a sec and see how much we can d double this up, all right? I'm going to do this deal and I'm going to cut this. I'm going to cut for a little bit. I'm going to come back in a few minutes, see how much we can token flip. I'll see you guys in a sec. Hey, never mind. I'm, I'm experiencing a glitch. I don't know if this has to do with the new update, but wow, wow, wow. I am sad. I am very, very sad. It's not letting me click the token. It's, it, it, it's, it's, um, hello? No. The problem here is now I can't leave and get the double up opportunity. You know what I mean? I can't get the double opportunity. I'm just stuck. Dude, no, why? Yeah, like if I, if I leave the game and come back, I'm basically going to be forfeiting my double up opportunity. What if I reset? What happens in this case? Never seen this. Never seen this before. Okay, I made it out here. Um, how many tokens did I get? I got 11. I think I got 11. So I got what I flipped for, but I couldn't double it up. I'm very, very sad. Probably not worth it. Let's just end the video by buying 16 chests and see what we get out of it. <laughs> And I'm going to spend the rest of my time doing some grinding on trying to get 
Nothing is working. Bro, I literally. I got. Uh, 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 I got to rejoin the game. So again, I didn't get my double up opportunity. I only have 16 tokens. We can at least buy 16 chests if the game lets us. There we go. 16. Let's do 16 and buy. All right, so we got two golds, four fountains, bad. One chair, one cup, bad. One gray, three pink, three silver, one blue. Not the best we could have gotten, but at least we got two, what, two or three golds? That's actually pretty good. I'll take that any day. That's pretty much it for this video, guys. Let me know what you guys thought. Let me know what you guys think of this update. I burped. And let me know if there's any, like, tips and tricks for a noob like me who wants to... Dang it. I didn't get a token. Um... Who wants to get more tokens? I just need to get an insane amount of tokens. What I'm probably going to do is just keep on doing the rebirth method without actually going all the way to the alien or maybe just going all the way to the alien. I just need to figure out is boost multiplier number better than the percentage or should I just go for a bunch of nature plaques and get this up to like 30, 40, 50,000 rather than spending the water potions on this. You know what I'm saying? Like what is more worth it? Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. I post a video every single day in this channel and I post two on my main channel. So go check that out as well. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching.